it's all fixable. But uh, the Democrats can't fix it. The Republicans can't fix it. They're all part of the problem. Well, they don't want to. They're. I thought it was hopeful. I think Trump wants to fix it. Well, he does, yeah. I don't think, I think he has a good instincts, but he doesn't have the depth. Oh, I think he does. You think he does? I, I think he well, does. Then why did he go along with the COVID lockdown? Uh, well, I think. Because he said, I'll never do it. Mm -hmm. And then he did it. And, uh, you know, he, he gets overwhelmed by his bureaucrats. Yeah, and I then, you know, he, he had this incredible deal where he went to. Korea, and he walked across the DMZ. The yeah, that was pretty amazing. Right? So, and, yeah. and all the liberals attacked him because he like he met with Kim, and and everybody said, "Oh, he likes dictators." But then he came back, and he created this um, this agreement to denuclearize the Korean Peninsula. And right. both Kim and that, at that time, the president of South Korea was uh, Moon Jae-in. Mm -hmm. And the two of them agreed, we're going to get rid of all nuclear weapons on this peninsula. How good would that be for the world? Then they went to President Xi in China, and he signed on to it. Right. And then uh, John Bolton, yeah. Mike Pompeo, mm -hmm. came to Trump and said, you can't do it. And he caved in. And he knew it was the right thing, but he didn't have the depth to say, I'm going to do it. What I think about him is that he has really good instincts. He had great instincts about the vaccines. He had great instincts about ivermectin. He had great mm -hmm. instincts about not shutting down our society, the social distancing, the masking, and many other things. But I, I think he gets rolled by his bureaucrats because he doesn't have the depth of knowledge.